What's up guys? Supreme Builds has updated Titanium for 2018. I've been waiting for this one because I love Titanium. So let's get started. Head over to your gear. File Manager. If you're in a build, go right to your File Manager. You want to add Source. Click in the box that says None. Their address is HTTPS colon forward slash forward slash repo dot supreme builds dot com okay make sure you put the s in there guys and hit okay now click in this box to give it a name you can call it anything you want just remember what you call it and hit okay now you can hit OK. There it is. We're going to back out. Go into Add-ons. If you're in a build, go into System, Add-ons. Come on here and click the box. Now we're going to Install from Zip File. Click on it. And come down here to the Repository Zip. Click on that. And wait till you get a pop-up. There you go. Okay, now we can install from repository. You want to look for Supreme. Supreme Builds Repository. Click there. Click on Program Add-ons and get the Supreme Builds Wizard. Click Install. There's your pop-up. Now you're going to get this. You can hit Dismiss. Okay, so now if you want to keep your login information, you want to click these on. So take a look and see what you want to keep. And keep my whitelist is if you have an add-on you want to keep that you can't get anymore, like Covenant. Then you want to click on that. It's really only good now for Real Debrid, and the new build has a replacement of a Covenant fork, but I like to hang on to it, that's up to you. So if you click keep my whitelist and hit continue, it's gonna pull this up and see what you wanna keep. There's Covenant. Covenant module. Covenant metadata. Covenant artwork. Okay, so when you're done, you hit click here to continue. And then you can click on the build menu. Okay, so it says these builds work on all versions of Kodi 17. Okay, so here you go. Here's Titanium version 3.2. There are three servers. And you can try any one of these servers. Doesn't matter of your location. So one's busy, try another one. So I'm going to try number two here. Okay, we're going to do a fresh install. And this comes up, hit continue. Now it's going to clear out everything unless you put them on the whitelist. Now it's downloading 246 megabytes, great size. Download super fast, I might add. So it adds up to 348 megabytes, which is still a pretty nice size. Okay, now force close Cody. That was the fastest build I've ever installed. Now you can reopen Kodi. And there we go, super fast. Okay, this says add-on required. To use this feature, you must download an add-on. Super favorites. So let's hit yes. 
installing super favorites. Okay guys, so here we are in movies. If you click on movies, it opens up Covenant, but only if you brought it with you because Covenant is not in this build. They may change this for an update mm -hmm. and have it direct somewhere else, but if you wanna use your Covenant, then bring it over. Otherwise, it's not here. But like I said, it's really only good with Real Debrid now. So if you want to use the alternate, I will show you that. But if you don't have Covenant, you're going to get a pop-up that wants you to install it, but it's not in this build. Mm -hmm. So that's why I suggested that you save it, because it is pulling right now when you click Movies. If you want to use Covenant, save it, and that's how you do it. But the replacement for Covenant is Placenta. <laughs> It is a fork of Covenant, so it looks very much like it, except for this one thing here where it puts this color on stuff. Some of the movie's artwork is not showing, but this add-on works really well. Um, so the artwork, I don't know what's going on with that with Placenta, because this widget list will pull from Placenta. So if you don't like the look of that, um, I can show you how to set up a different add-on for widgets. Okay, so let's continue. So they have Placenta, Neptune Rising, The Pyramid, which has new artwork, very nice. Bob, not sure, UK Turk. Then you can search title, actor. You can do trending in theaters, genres, and years. So let's click on trending here and see which it pulls up, Placenta also. So because you can get placenta this way and this way, maybe you want your widgets to pull something else. Mm -hmm. So I'll show you that later. Next we have TV shows. Same ones, placenta, Neptune Rising, Bob Unleashed, Not Sure, and UK Turk. So this one is pulling up fine for artwork. Let's see where it's coming from. Also placenta. So I guess it's just some of the movies having a little trouble with the artwork. Mm -hmm. So you get placenta here, you get placenta here, and here it is down here. All right, very good. So you have search by title, search by actor, trending, genres, languages, and networks. Let's click on networks. And you can pick your TV networks here. That is a nice feature, I like that. Okay, we're gonna skip over for a second and show you how to change that widget because then we're gonna finish up on the box. Okay, so let's go into video add-ons. And you can change the look of this from the side here if you wanna see the thumbnails. So I'm gonna pick Neptune Rising. Movies and in theaters. So what you need to do here is long press on your center remote or hit the button with the three lines and you wanna to add to favorites. Or you can choose another video add-on of your choice. Then we're gonna go into skin settings. And here we go, home menu items. So you can just click up here to change them. You'll see at the top menu item. Let's go to movies. Okay, so the widget is pulling here. You can see placenta. So if you want to change that, click on it. And you want to go to custom widgets favorites. So this looks like Neptune Rising in theaters. And just hit the X. And now you can see that it's pulling from Neptune in theaters. So let's go take a look at that. So now when you scroll over to movies, you can see it's pulling up all the widgets and you can see them much better. And let's check it. Yep, Neptune Rising. So guys, you can customize this any way you like it. You can put whatever widgets you like the best, whatever add-on you like the best. It's always a good idea to customize things. I like to do that myself. I also want to show you how to add an add-on. Okay, so to add an add-on, you go into File Manager, and you add Source. Same instructions as usual on that. Then, after you've added your Source, 
you go into main menu, you click add-ons, you install it from zip file, and then install from repository. Okay? Then your new video add-on will be in video add-ons. So we're going to go in there and I'm going to show you with one I already have how to add it to the menu. So we're going to go in and the only one I have in here that's not in the build is Covenant so I'll use that as an example. So you can long press on Covenant or you can use the button with the three lines and you can add to favorites. Okay, while you're here, there's errors that come up for Vader streams. So you need to uninstall it. If you're going to be using Vader, you need to reinstall it. So we'll go to information and uninstall and say yes. Okay, so we'll get rid of that pop up. Okay, so once it's a favorite, we go into skin settings and add on shortcuts. Up here, user selection add-on. By clicking the arrows, you can go to the different categories. So under TV shows, there's two slots open. You can always click on one that you might not use by clicking on it and replacing it also. So let's go into movies. There's a slot open here, so you can put a new add-on if you add one. So this is how you do it. So you click on it, go into selected favorites, and look for the favorites that you made. Okay, so there's Covenant. I'm going to click on it. And you can rename it. So to make it look exactly the same, you need to put in all the brackets for the color and the bold. So we'll start with the bold, a bracket, a B, and bracket, a new bracket, color, space, gold, and the bracket. Then type the name of the add-on you're going to use. Then start a new bracket, forward slash color, and bracket, start bracket, forward slash B, and end the bracket. So make sure you press pause and do it exactly like this. And when you're ready, hit done. And you can see that it looks exactly the same as the others. So when you back out and you go into movies, there it is and it's written just like the rest. So remember you can do that with any add-on. This was the only one that I had, so I did it with Covenant to give you an idea of how it works. So let's test it out versus placenta, which is the fork. Let's go into movies, people watching, and let's try Justice League. I have my real debris in here, which is really the only way you should be using Covenant at all because you'll pull up more. Covenant's not being maintained, so there'll be no more scrapers added and that includes with real debris, so it only scrape what it knows. So you will get some with real debris, but hardly any on normal. So you're getting three 1080s, five 720s, and only three 720s normally. Okay, so now let's look at placenta, which is the fork, movies, people watching, and Justice League. So that's pulling a lot more. So placenta is working really great. So, you know, you can get the links either way. You'll get more out of placenta. So it's up to you. Sometimes it's hard to forget an old favorite, but eventually it'll be no good. So we have other options here. A lot of great add-ons to choose from in this build. So let's try Neptune Rising. In Neptune Rising, you need to enable Debrid Providers. Let's go by year. 2017. And let's see what they get for Justice League.
Wow, that's pulling quite a lot. This will mix them together, the real to bread and the normal links that you can pull. So look at all these debreds, that's a lot. That's like 16 real debreds that that one pulled up. And a bunch other 1080s, so I think Neptune Rising is working the best. Especially with real debred, really, really good. So that's great, you have a lot of choices here. My add-on of choice is Neptune Rising. I like it the best. Pulls a lot of links. And now we have it hooked up at the top. And there's a bunch of debrids in here too. So it's real, working really well with debrid. Lots and lots of links. So that's my choice. I use Neptune Rising. That's why I like it up here for my widgets. You can also customize the submenu, and that's the same way. If you want to do My Movies, if you enter your tracked information, that would be a great one. So you would just add to favorites the same way. After you set up your tracked and your skin settings, the submenu that's right down below. Go over to movies and you can change any of these things and you can direct it to the add-on you want with the subject that you want so it's it's so customizable it's really great so I'm going to change languages because I don't really need that so when you click on it you want to scroll down until you get to selected favorites so sort through the ones you've chosen and find the one you want So I picked my movies, so that'll pull up tracked. This one you do not need to change the colors because it's in the sub menu, it should be okay. So let's back out and take a look. Okay, so it should be if you scroll over, there it is, my movies. So there, the color doesn't matter. So I didn't set up tracked yet, but if you did, see? If you did, your whole tracked account would be here. So there are so many things you can do to make it your own. So I just wanted to set up an entire category with you. So we're done with movies and you can do the same thing here in TV shows and throughout the whole menu. Okay guys, now I'm gonna hop on over to my box. There are some Android specific things I need to show you there. So you get this message. To use this feature, you must download the add-on Covenant, but it's not available in this build if you hit yes it won't show up. So that's why I suggested that you save your covenant. If you want to still use it with Real Debrid, then you can click on movies and you can get covenant. I mean, there may be an update where they take that out, but for now it's right there so you can use it. Okay, so next is Free Live TV and they have Not Sure, Mobdina, Sports Hub, Sports Devil, UK Turk, Goodfellas, made in Canada. So there's Mobjo Entertainment, Mobdina Entertainment, Mobjo Sports, Mobdina Sports, MLB Live, NBA Live. And you can scroll along the top, make your choices from there. And next category is Sport Replays. There's Planet MMA, Bob Unleashed, Sports Hub, Wrestling On Demand, UFC, Bellator, Boxing, Wrestling, MLB, NBA, and your widgets up here. Next is the Combat Zone with Boxing, MMA, and Wrestling. And then we have the Kids Zone, Cartoon Crazy, Bobby's Cartoons, Toons R Us, B99 TV, 
Bob's Kids, Anime, Kids Movies, Pyramid Kids Zone, UK Turks Cartoons, and Walt Disney Movies. You can choose some of these up here. And these pull from Neptune Rising. Very nice. Next is Spanish. Adrian List, Base Fox. Some things I might pronounce wrong. So take a look at that. And next is Gears TV. So this is a paid IPTV. And next is Vader Streams, another paid IPTV. And then PVR plus subs paid IPTV. There's Sports Access and Limitless. So if you don't need these services, you don't want this on your menu, I'll show you how to take it off. But it's a good option to have if you are. So next is Music. For Music, they have Thunderstruck, YouTube Music, Jukebox Hero, Beats, MP3 Streams, Search Artists, Albums, Songs, iTunes Charts, Billboard Charts, and Popular Vivo List. You can also make selections up at the top. And next is Android apps, which is really convenient. It shows you at the top all the apps you already have. So you can open Terrarium there or you can open Terrarium here. But you need to have them installed, don't forget. I'll show you how to do that. So they have Terrarium, Mobjo, LiveNet TV, YouTube, Plex, and Amazon Video. Down below, they're not showing because I don't have them. So we can also remove those items. I'll show you how to do that. But let me show you how nice this is. So I have Terrarium, so let me click on that. And that pulls up Terrarium, so it's really nice. Look at that. Then you head back twice and you get back to your build so that is really convenient so you can pull them from up at the top as well open up any of these things great stuff this is my favorite part of the build right here then we get to the main menu where you have the wizard a total cleanup you can clear old data clear crash logs view log errors and force close coding in the submenu, you have your settings, file manager to add new add-ons, skin settings, video add-ons, program add-ons, and music add-ons. If you click on main menu, this brings up your system. So if you look up at the top here, there's add-on installer, APK installer, builds, contact, maintenance, save data, and build reviews. So if you wanna get some APKs, let's go into APK Installer. There we go. You can get some forks for SBMC here. Media, video players, streaming, live TV, movie apps, IPTV services app, Droid Buddy APK Installer, Torrent Streaming Engines, Android Remotes, VPN Clients, Web Browsers, and Lean Back Launcher App Shortcuts, Quick Server Apps. So we would probably like to grab some movie apps. There's Live TV Net here. There's Terrarium TV with ads or no ads. Movie HD, Amazon Prime Video, and Showbox. So let's see what version they have for Terrarium. It doesn't say what version it is. If you wanna grab some of these, you can go right ahead. I can also link you my video for APK time that has tons of APKs. Doesn't matter where you get it from, as soon as it's on your device, it's gonna show up. 
So I'm scrolling down to the bottom because I was having trouble backing out. I'm going to hit that little home there. So if you have any trouble backing out, make sure you do that. Go down to the little home icon and it'll bring you to the home screen here. Also down here, this is favorites. When you add favorites, you can access them there. And next to it is power. So it's good to do that after you've made some changes. Okay, so let's do a little customizing now. Let's go into our skin settings. The other thing you can do is go to the different menus. And if you're not going to use that, you can take it out. So there's a Spanish one. If you're not going to use it, you're going to scroll down where it says menu item, click on it, and you can clear menu option. Then you can go back up here. If you're not going to be using gears, same thing, click on it, clear menu option. Same with Vader. So if you're using them or you think you might use them, good idea to keep them there. But if you're definitely not using them, like PVR subs, clear, clear menu option. So now let's go down to add on shortcuts. So under Android launcher, I didn't have any of these things, so they weren't showing up. So we can take those out. Clear menu option clear menu option. Again, I don't recommend doing this if you think these are in your future, but if they are not in your future, you can just clear it out and customize this for you. So now you can see those other menu items are gone and that way you don't skip through stuff that you don't need. Let's go into Android apps here. and that'll show you all the ones that you have. So if you want one to show up there, you can just click the button with the three lines or long press your center button, add to favorites. So I'm doing a little custom menu for myself for things I use a lot. Or things I wanna see down below. And let's do Firefox. Okay, so we've added those to our favorites. Let's go into skin settings. Add on shortcuts and Android launcher, and you can change it here if it's not on that. Add on one, selected favorites. Okay, first I'm going to do IP Vanish. And then you can rename it or leave it. Hit done. Add on to selected favorites. I will do Terrarium. Done. Add on three. Selected favorites. APK time. Done. I'll show you a video for that if you want to get it, if you don't have it yet. We'll do File Explorer. FireZL. And Firefox. Okay, so there's room for one more, but that's good for me. 
Let's back out and take a look. So scroll over to Android apps and look, there they are at the bottom. How great is that? I love it. Awesome. Back out. Isn't this great? I love this. And this is why this is my favorite build. Because I find it so convenient. I love this part. All right, guys, I'm super happy with this. I love titanium. I love the update. I think it's so great. Big shout out to Supreme Builds. This is totally supreme. Thank you so much, everyone. I hope you enjoy it. Be sure to check out these videos to supercharge your build even more. I love Real Debrid and Tracked. I think you're going to love it too.